Good afternoon, YouTubers. Welcome back to my channel. I'm Joseph Magi, author of Playing Card Divination and Fortune Telling, The Magi Method. You can find the book worldwide on Amazon and Kindle and paperback versions. Find the full color card deck used here on Etsy slash Magi Method. Feel free to like, share, subscribe, comment. This afternoon we want to do uh, love and romance for the air signs. Gemini, Libra, and Aquarius for February 2019. Love and Romance for the Air Signs. Gemini, Libra, and Aquarius. I've already shuffled the cards. I've already prayed over them. Let's see what they want to tell us. Love and Romance. Ten Pentacles. Well, and the Hermit. Uh, you may be preferring your own company at this point, and you may be working very hard. It may not be a wonderful month. Air signs are prone to be lawyers and in sales, and, well, sales is very emotion-oriented, but air can be quite good at that as well, depending on the mixture. Uh, you may be focusing on career. Okay, this wants to fall out. King of Spades, Executioner. Let's see what the other cards want to tell us. Love and Romance for the Air Signs. Strength, Mustard Seed, Incubus Succubus, and Three Blackbirds. And Executioner. Okay. So mustard seed is a new planting, bad relationship, uh, dating sort of in a bad relationship. Uh, strength is firmly rooted or a young man and planting with a young man or jacks are male or female and executioner, executioner cuts it off. So you may be decide to cut off a relationship with something that's been going on for a while or or that's new a mustard seed is brand new strength is kind of more deeply rooted but it looks like this relationship is not working out and you will decide to cut it off and you're going to keep all of the marbles it doesn't look like you're losing anything here a diamonds, cornucopia is money and material things, cornerstone, two spades. Okay. So, good solid foundation, very solid financial fin foundation. Two, two money, financial, that's money uh, and finances. This is a solid foundation, very solid, and you're going to cut it off. You may decide to break this because of the finances they may be very immature jacks are very immature very irresponsible they may be very irresponsible with money and they may be spending your money and you may just decide uh the cost benefit is just not there it's just not really worth it okay man wants to fall out Fox, an olive tree, angel, man, similar energies. Man is a good man, angel is a well-meaning individual or a child. You may decide for the benefit of your child that you need to cut this off. Fox is, uh, Fox is very often a single woman or a person with red hair, uh, Donald Trump, even though he's a man, often comes up as the fox. He comes as, up as the fox or the magi because of the red in the card. He has red hair. So, fox in the olive tree. Fox uh, can be manipulative and deceptive and less than truthful. 
12 and 6, 18, 5 diamonds. You know, on an ongoing basis, um, you're just feeling that accumulated, this person is out for their own gain. And you need to cut it off and it's a bad relationship. And you make an executive decision. Big change. Big change in the outcome. Okay, so at the end of this, in February, air signs, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, I see you making a big change. Okay, you're not going to lose anything. You're going to decide it's just time to be single for a while. You've been in a bad situation, a bad relationship, and you've been maybe dating the wrong person, and you're investing either short-term or long-term in kind of the wrong person, and you've decided to just cut it off. You're going to keep, uh, it's, it's, you're just looking at the actual situation. You're looking at the material situation, money and the material situation, and they're just not a match for you. They're just not a match. Um, and this person is really out for their own gain. This fox can be a male or female. Uh, and it's just not the right person to settle down with, grow roots with. Uh, and you're going to make a big change uh, and decide to be, probably decide to be single for a little bit. Let's see what else the tarot wants to tell us. Hierophant. Lovers. Four Pentacles. Okay, and the Queen of Spades. So, the Hierophant does things the right way. This is marriage. Either this was not leading to marriage. Okay, this is not leading to a permanent relationship. Uh, and that's what you really want. You want the security of a permanent relationship and marriage. And the Queen, the Queen of Wands, is willing to do what it takes to achieve her goals. And the black cat shows that she's willing to, this is the dark side of the queen of wands. Wands are about action. She, you know, she is, takes strong action in the situation because she's a female action situation, but she's willing to, to do, you know, uh, the, the black cat is, she's willing to do even dark things to achieve what needs to be done. So what I'm seeing for you, Air Signs, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, is you're in a relationship that is not really serving you. Okay, and it can be a, a recent, a more recent or a a more rooted relationship. You just make the make the cut, you make the decision. Maybe you ghost this person, okay, and you just simply look at the situation. And realize they're not a match. They're just not a match. You have to find someone who matches you. Uh, they're too independent. They're just, uh, they're not the right person to grow roots with. And so it's, you just make it, you just make a big change. You make a big change. You'll probably decide to be single for a while. Uh, the Ten Pentacles has everything. This is the inheritance retirement card. Uh, this man has everything. He's sitting in the gate. He has a good name. He has money and he's retired and he has, and he's watching his grandchildren. He has everything. Okay. Here, it's time to do it the right way. Okay. The Hierophant is about doing it the right way. Blessed by God. The Hierophant gives a blessing, God's blessing on the relationship. Find a really good, solid, very solid relationship. No obvious flaws. Do what you need to do to find this really nice, solid relationship and let go of this relationship that is just not going to work out. Just see it for what it is. And that's what these cards are saying. So best of luck to you, uh, air signs. That's how I see it. I'm Joseph Magi, author of Playing Card Divination, Fortune Telling the Magi Method. 
Find the book worldwide on Amazon and Kindle and paperback versions. Find the full color card deck used here on Etsy slash Magi Method. Please like, share, subscribe, comment.